Hey, what's up, everyone? Welcome to the Bowtie Breakdown. I'm Gary Morin. Thanks for tuning in. Today, I'm going to explain the differences between pending and active under contract listings. I'm almost positive that while you've been searching for a new home, you have definitely come across pending and active under contract listings, especially in this market. You're probably wondering to yourself, what's the difference? Well, let's start with the active under contract status. Simply explained, that means that they do indeed have a deal with a signed purchase and sales agreement. However, because of that keyword active under contract, that means the property should, in theory, still be available for showings. This particular status is commonly used during the home inspection period, and it can be used as a way to solicit backup offers for the seller. Now, let's talk about the pending status. That means the buyers have completed their home inspection process and are moving forward with the transaction. So that means the property is no longer available for any showings and all parties are now waiting for the loan to close. Does that make sense? Now, this is exactly how these two statuses are supposed to be used. However, not all realtors use them correctly. That's why I wanted to share this information with you. If you found this video helpful, hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe for new videos. That was another Bowtie Breakdown. I'm Gary Moore and the Bowtie Guy. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next week.